my sophomore year at Penn State. I'd come in as a as a freshman, and you know, um, no one knew who I was. Um, I was just like the new kid on the block, and you know, I had great players around me, so I had a pretty successful freshman year, um, and kind of, you know, you know, I was I was my own biggest fan. I was I was kind of you know, um, not full of myself, but I was. I thought I was. I thought I had arrived. I thought I was the best I was going to be as a soccer player, and that was really. Uh, I, my eyes were opened up my sophomore year, um, and Erica said, "Look, um, if you're not going to work hard and you're not going to um, push yourself, um, you know, I don't think you should be in our starting eleven." And she had those conversations with me behind closed doors of saying, "Hey, I want what's best for you, and I'm gonna have, I'm gonna tell you how it is." And I think that's how we developed our our relationship. Our player coach relationship was all built on respect and trust. And she would be one of my harshest critics, but also one of my biggest fans, and she still is to this day. Um, she actually texted me uh, last week because I scored my first goal this season. So um, she's one of those people who have kind of molded me into into the player that I am and she but more of the mental side of the game she challenged me um, to always strive for something more and to be not so hard on myself I think that's what it all came down to is I wanted to be the best um, but if I made one mistake you know my head would go down I would drop and you know it was all about how I reacted to that and that's you know talking with Erica and my dad it was all about you know you're gonna make mistakes but it's how you react is how people are gonna judge you and that still is so true to this day is, you know especially at the professional level you're gonna you're gonna give the ball away you're gonna have bad days of training you're not gonna start you're not gonna score you know but it's easy to give up and just to say you know what hey soccer's not for me but at the end of the day it's all about how you react and that's that's what I want people to remember me by is, yes, she made all those mistakes, but, you know, look at the things she's like she's doing now and she's, you know, working on her hustle or she's working on this shot and she's just getting better each and every day. And I think that's that's something I've tried to continue since my uh, sophomore year at Penn State. And, you know, my senior year, we got to the national championship. So uh, credit goes to Erica Walsh for really getting me out of my own head. Setting up the Long ball in, plays on the four for Nair. Nair, 30 yards from goal, rips it and puts it in the corner. Oh my, Christine Nair might have summoned a late winner from that laser beam.